Good morning kids! I am Teacher Lance and I'll be your teacher for today. Today we are going to study reading and the topic that we will discuss will be Mike's Bike. We are already in the Unit 3 of our reading. So now, let's go and learn more in it. We are going to begin first with the vocabularies. Those are the new words that we are going to encounter within the story. So let's go and study it. The first picture or the first word that we are going to learn is this one. So let's try to find out what is this. Is it A, wheel, B, bell, C, ride, or D, hole? What do you think is this picture? Very good. It is letter C, ride. When you say ride, you are using a bicycle um, or any vehicle and then you're going to ride on it. Okay? We call it ride. We use it for transportation. Number two, what is this? Is it A, wheel, B, bell, C, ride? Or D, hole. What do you think is this? Okay, very good. So the correct answer is letter A. It's a wheel. We use it on the cars or vehicles. Okay, we call it wheel. What about this picture? What is this? Is it A, wheel, B, bell? C. Ride or D. Hole. Clue. We use it to produce a sound to let people know that we are coming. We call it... Very good! The answer is letter B. Bell. We call it bell. This is the red one. Okay? So let's go to the number 4. What is this? Is it A. Wheel. B. Bell, C, ride, or D, hole. What do you think is this picture? Okay, it is called letter D, hole. When a wheel has a hole, we cannot use it unless we repair this or replace with a new one. We call it hole, okay? So let's go to completing the sentence. For number 5, we have the sentence, I ride my bike to school. Blank. I ride my bike to school blank. Mm, it means from Monday to Friday. What is it? Is it A. Every day? B. Bike? C. Ringing? Or D. Fast? What do you think is the answer? Good job! The correct answer is letter A. Every day. Every day means from Monday to Friday. We call it every day. So the sentence will be, I ride my bike to school every day. And for the number 6, the bell is blank. Can you hear it? The bell is blank. Can you hear it? Is it A. Every day? B. Bike? C. Ringing? Or D. Fast? What do you think is the answer? Okay, good job! The correct answer is... Letter C. Ringing. The bell is ringing. That sounds like a telephone. Can you hear it? Okay, when the bell is ringing, that means that the bell is producing sound. It is making a noise. Number seven, my bike can go blank. It's fun. Oh, what can you see in the picture? Is it A, every day, B, bike, C, ringing, or D, fast? What do you think is the answer? Good job! The correct answer is letter D. Fast. My bike can go fast. 
It's fun. Okay, kids. Very good. So for the number 8, I love my blank. It is red and blue. What can you see in the picture? What is red and blue? Is it A, every day? B, bike? C, ringing? Or D, fast? What do you think? Good job! The correct answer is letter B, bike. I love my bike. It is red and blue. Okay, so let's go to the story. Here we are going to know more about Mike and his bike. Okay, are you ready kids? Okay, I know you are. Let's go and dive into it. Mike likes his bike. His bike is red. Mike cleans it every day. His bike has two wheels. Mike looks for holes in them every day. His bike has a bell. Mike rings it every day. His bike can go fast. Mike rides it every day. So now, we're going to read the story again. And we are going to understand it, okay? So let's go. Mike likes his bike. Oh, as we can see here, Mike loves his bike. His bike is red. So the color of his bike is red. Mike cleans it every day. Oh, Mike really loves his bike because he cleans it every day. What about you? Do you clean your bike too? His bike has two wheels. Commonly, the bicycle has two wheels because that is the reason why we call it bicycle. Because bike means two, okay? His bike has two wheels. Next one, Mike looks for holes in them every day. So, in order to make sure that he will not have an accident, Mike always looks for holes in them okay that is good for your safety kids so you should do it too his bike has a bell okay mike's bike has a bell as we can see in the picture it is a bell mike rings it every day so mike always rings his bell next one his bike can go fast. As we can see in the clip, he is riding his bike very fast. Mike rides it every day. Mike always uses his bike from Monday to Friday. So now that we already understand the story, we are going to check how much we understand it by the reading questions. Let's go! We have the number one. What is the story about? Is it A. Going to a bike store? B. A boy with a bike? C. Making a bike? Or D. A bike with a bell? What do you think is the story about? Good job! The correct answer is letter B. A boy with a bike. And the name of that boy is Mike. Okay, so let's go to number two. When does he ride his bike? When does Mike ride his bike? A. After school. B. At night. C. Every day. Or D. Before breakfast. What do you think? When does Mike use his bike? Good job! The correct answer is letter C. Every day. He uses his bike every 
single day. Okay? Next one, number three. Blank on Mike's bike wings. Blank on Mike's bike wings. Is it A, the bell? B, the wheel? C, the hole? Or D, the day? So what do you think is ringing on Mike's bike? Of course, the correct answer is letter A. The bell is ringing. Okay? Let's go to the next part, which is do it. Okay? We're going to choose from the following number. Okay? We're going to look at the picture and see the letters on it, right? Like A, B, C, and D. And then there are numbers with underlines before it. So what we're going to do is to look at the picture and look at the letter on it and then write it on the number that it belongs, okay? For example, number one, oh, letter A, it is um, a seat, right? It is a bicycle seat. So what do we do with it? Is it number one, rings it, number two, sits on it, number three, checks for holes, or number four, puts his foot on it? So what do we do with the seat? Of course, it is number two. We sit on it, okay? So that is what we are going to do. So let's go to number, so let's go to letter B. So what do we do with it? With, with the pedals, right? What do we do with the pedals? Is it number one, rings it? Number two, sits on it? Number three, checks for holes? Or number four, puts his foot on it? So what do we do with the pedals? Very good, of course, it is number four. We put our foot or feet on it, right? We put our feet on it. And then, we start to riding the bicycle. And then, we start to ride the bicycle, okay? Okay, for the letter C, we have this picture. It is a wheel, right? So what do we do with the wheel? Number one, rings it. Number two, sits on it. Number three, checks for holes. Number four, puts his feet on it. So what do we do with the wheel? Very good. The correct answer is let number three. We check the holes in it, right? So we put letter C on number three, okay? And lastly, we have the letter D. So what do we do with it? Is it number one? Rings it. Number two, sits on it. Number three, checks for holes. Or number four, puts his foot on it. So what do we do with it? Very good. The correct answer is number one. Of course, we ring the bell on the bicycle. So now we're going to practice it. What are we going to do is to circle the right word, okay? Number one, I blank a bike. I blank a bike. Is it has or have? What are we going to circle? Very good. I have a bike. When we see the words I, we, or they, we are going to use have, okay? But when we see he, she, or it, we're going to write has, okay? So let's go. Does your bike has or have a bell? Does your bike has or have a bell? So what do you think is the correct answer? Has or have? Actually, when we see you or your, what we're going to use is also have, okay? So the answer here is have. Does your bike have a bell? Okay, very good, kids. For the number three, my wheel blank a hole. My wheel blank a hole. Is it has or have? Good job. The correct answer is has because it is singular, okay? My will is a singular noun, so we're going to use the singular verb has, okay? 
my wheel has a hole. Very good, kids. So this is it. Okay, circle has. Number four, the bike has or have big wheels. The bike blank big wheels. So what is the answer here? Is it has or have? Okay, very good. The correct answer is has. The bike has big wheels. Good job, very good. So we're going to do listen for it. Of course, we have to listen for the words that teacher Lance will say, okay? Number one, you're going to circle ring or ride, okay? So what did you hear from me? Number one, he likes to ride his bike. He likes to ride his bike. Is it ring or ride? What did you hear from me? Good job! The correct answer is ride. Because I said he likes to ride his bike. Number two, his bike has big wheels. His bike has big wheels. Is it bells or wheels? What did I say? Okay, so you're going to circle wheels. Okay, so let's go to number three. His bike can go fast. His bike can go fast. Okay, so what do we answer here? Fast or slow? What did they say a while ago? Mm, did you remember? Okay, the correct answer is fast. His bike can go fast. Number four, Mike cleans his bike every day. Mike cleans his bike every day. What do we answer here? Cleans or likes? What do you think? Good job! The correct answer is cleans. Mike cleans his bike every day. So this is the last part of our lesson for today. It will be right in. We're going to pick from the words given here. It is on the right part of your book. And then you're going to put it on the underline to complete the sentence, okay? So we have the sentence, the black is red. The blank is red. Okay, so which is red? Is it A, bell, B, bike, or C, ride? Which of the following is red? Very good. The answer is letter B, bike. The bike is red, okay? Very good, kids. So number two, they blank their bikes outside. They blank their bikes outside. Is it A, bell, B, bike, or C, ride? What do you think? Good job, the correct answer is letter C, ride. They ride their bikes outside, okay? Good job, kids. Number three, this blank is on a bike. This blank is on a bike. Is it A, bell, B, bike, C, ride? What do you think? Good job! The correct answer is letter A. This bell is on a bike. Very good. So that is all for today. Today we studied the parts of the bike and also we were able to know Mike. A boy who really loves his bike, okay? I hope that you learned something from Teacher Lance and also I hope that you enjoyed this class. Goodbye and happy learning!